I was really interested by the brief that they proposed, so this in pursuit of imperfection. I looked at this idea of perfection and what does it mean, um, and I came up with the definition of perfection is something without flaws. I started actually with photography and looking at different images that were imperfect, particularly in nature, because nature has a great way of producing itself and reproducing itself with unique skins all the time. I was really interested in like, apples, for instance, and how they have a skin that's different all the time, but they have the same shape. You know, every morning I wake up and then I, obviously I can see the like trees, you know, every single leaf, it has a, its own like shape, so never has a same shape. I didn't like mean to design a clock, but I'm trying to start to think about what's the time, what is it, and then trying to see what's our perception of time, object that we call it as a clock, which is just a visualization of the time with uh, the numbers we created. You know, like clock, even though it doesn't show the proper time, but it seems quite like, how can I say it, cute? I came across this rusted door and I thought it was quite interesting the way that a steel sheet can colour itself brown um, and also the steel sheet that I saw had like some patterns on it. It looks at the idea of imperfection on both sides, so it's something which produces an imperfect pattern all the time, so no two rust patterns are the same, but it's also something that's imperfect because rust is something that people always want to get rid of. So I thought it would be interesting to go down that way. That's how I carried on with material like experimentation and colouring different metals and like creating these different recipes to tarnish metals and creating these different solutions and having the material influence the product. If I know what process will be involved for the process, then I wouldn't start. <laughs> It's amazingly really like challenging and sometimes very like painful. We think that we kind of managing manage the time, but actually time is something that just goes on. I think the next step with Mr. Club be uh, finding a right manufacturer who can develop it like further. I really. I think it will be great to see a direction where we can produce products which um, are unique or responsive to the individual. Um, so empowering them, highlighting them and not just mass producing one of everything for everyone. Mm -hmm.